well, um, today is day off and I intend on having a, um, a fun time with just going for a massive ride. So I've got my camera on um, taking a shot every five seconds or so and uh, I'll try and uh, do a bit of a um, commentary along the way here and there. Okay, well I'm going to have fun and I hope you enjoy this video. Now I thought it might also be interesting just to um, show you some of the other stuff that I've been up to. I've been trying out different camera angles and um, the Velomobile's gone to numerous places. So during the making of this video I've also got little uh, sections and segments where I've just put something completely different um, about some of the other stuff I've been up to. Um, that might be of interest as well, so even if you're not interested in this ride, just have a quick um, quick look through and just see if there's any of that other stuff that you might be interested in having a look at. Okay, hope you enjoy the video. Well, I'm just about to leave the area, um, the central area of Blenheim, and I'm going to be on my way to Renwick um, before carrying on on this the rest of this uh, long, hopefully long trip. Okay. Well, I'm feeling strong and uh, should be a good ride. Well, I'm, uh, I'm only just beginning really, and um, but I'm nice and warmed up now and I might keep my ju jumper on for just a little bit longer. Um, I'm not using the battery at the moment, I'm just cruising around. I seem to be going about 20, 25k an hour. Um, and uh, well, I'll look forward to getting on a little bit further. Still feeling pretty strong, so uh, should be a good day. The weather's looking promising.
Well, I'm just in Renwick now, and um, this is uh, the first little sort of town outside of the um, village, I guess, outside of the Blenheim town. And um, I've got a long way to go yet, but I'm enjoying the ride so far. And uh, normally I'd be zipping along here at around 40 to 50 kilometers per hour because um, I'd be using the electric assist and just going full blast and because it's normally short distance. But today, because I'm going such a long distance, uh, my plan is to um, conserve the battery and then hopefully enjoy a bit more of that speed from the battery on the way back. Alright, well that's all for the moment and see you on the next little clip. And this is just keeps me out of the rain and it makes me a little bit faster on a, on a flat because it, the wind cuts through the wind really well. Well, I, um, I normally have a visor over here and um, it's a bit of a love-hate relationship. It's, uh, it's great to have um, when, the wind is, when the weather is cold and the wind chill, it stops the wind chill up against your face. Um, but in my opinion, it's also a little bit hard to see through. Um, so, and especially today, it's, uh, it was fogging up quite a bit and uh, difficult to see with. So I've decided to take away take away the uh, visor and we'll just um, see how I go without it for a bit. Should be alright. Okay that's all for now and I'll catch you on the next clip. Those guys there are the ones that are in front in this particular race. He did really well. Well, I'm uh, just about to head into the um, Wairau Valley and uh, it's great. It's a great place to ride here today. Um, there's basically well, next to no traffic um, because of the uh, holiday today. And uh, so I feel very, very good and very strong at the moment. And uh, well, there's no no better place that I can think of right now to be riding. I mean, just over there, um, I can see 
snow-capped mountains and I've just come from Blenheim which is just a, a, a tiny little ride away from the beach um, and in the meantime I get to see lush forests and vineyards and rivers and all sorts it's just fantastic scenery so I'm going to keep enjoying this ride and I'll catch you on the next clip well I'm in the um, what I would call the heart of um, Wairau Valley now and I'm definitely getting a bit hot steaming up a little bit just putting on a bit of a sweat um, but I'm actually quite enjoying it and I suppose I could take off my jumper but I, I might keep it on just for a little while and see how we go all right catch you on the next clip Here's a sight I didn't expect. There's a guy on a tour bike. He's a little bit all over the road. Might be a lady, I'm not sure. Um, anyway, I'm gonna pass him. The road's pretty clear. But um, yeah, it really needs to stick to the left. Anyway. Hello. Oh, well. well. See how she goes. Well, here I am. I just thought I'd see if I can video the a cyclist that's uh, she's got a lot of stuff that she's carrying. I'm very curious how heavy her bike must be. Anyway, um, we'll see how we go with that. I didn't expect to see this, but there was a place open that's got some ice cream by the looks of things, so that's going to be me. I'm going to have an ice cream and a, and a break, and then I'll carry on my way. Okay, that's all for now. And I just crossed over there. Well, it's uh, the first time I turned on my electric assist and um, used the full power available to me uh, just to get to the top of that hill and then uh, I'm going to enjoy a nice quick ride down. But first I'm going to have a drink and uh, maybe something to eat and then I'll carry on my way. Alright, till the next clip. Well, I just made it to my uh, road called Rainbow Road and it heads off to the ski field. Uh, I'm definitely not getting to those places today, but I'm going to see how far I can get before I got to turn around and head back home. Um, yeah, I'm feeling pretty strong. Legs are a little bit tired, so I might give, the, give my wife a call and just let her know that I'm okay and uh, that I'm on this road now, uh, just in case something happens. All right. Well, I'm on the right road. Um, and uh, it looks like I'm able to ride here, but uh, I think I might actually turn around and head back um, just because uh, it took me a long time to get out here, perhaps a bit slower than I would have liked. And um, there's no cell phone reception here, so if I do get stuck, then I need to find a, a way to be able to get back out and stuff. And I don't want to walk too far if I end up having to walk. Um, so, uh, yeah, so I'm going to turn around, head back, and um, I'll just carry on making these little comments every now and then. Okay, that's all for the moment. Well, I've changed my uh, battery for my lights, um, so that should be fresh to go. I've also turned my uh, normal little flashing lights, my red and my white ones, on. I'm going to get back on the highway, and uh, well, seeing I've used next to no assist to get here, 
um, I'm just going to fully blast it and use up as much battery for my motor as I can. And uh, yeah, I'll just enjoy the ride back, I guess. All right, that's all for the moment. Well, I uh, just put the visor back on um, just to stop some of the wind from hitting my hitting me in the head. Uh, and uh, later on, I'll probably change out the battery um, for the motor as well. And then uh, that'll be me. I'll just head all the way home. Um, yeah, catch up with you on my next clip. Well, just changed out the battery for my motor. And, uh, so battery now and it looks also like the, uh, the camera here has um, run out of uh, space I think and uh, so I'm just going to carry on get back home and uh, if I can I'll stop somewhere and make another little comment and uh, yeah that's all for now feeling good going well